With their city now completely exposed to the Persian invaders, the desperate Athenians turned to the god Apollo for advice. At Delphi, Apollo's priestess, always a wise, graceful woman, would give voice to the god's prophecies in cryptic riddles. On this occasion, her advice to the Athenians was unusually clear and utterly terrifying. Flee, she told them. Flee to the ends of the earth. The Athenians begged for a second audience. Apollo, apparently forgiving this impertinence, now offered one ray of hope. Whatever else may occur, intoned his priestess, the wooden wall would remain intact. This was very encouraging, until the Athenians realized that they had no idea what the wooden wall was supposed to be. Some argued that it meant the palisade around the Acropolis and wanted to make their stand there, but Themistocles persuaded the Athenians otherwise. The wooden wall, he said, meant the fleet. And so the people of Athens extinguished their hearths, left behind the tombs of their ancestors, and trudged down to the harbor at Piraeus, there to board the fleet with all they could carry. After ferrying the women and children across the Saronic Gulf, the fleet moored in the Bay of Salamis with the rest of the Greek allies. There, they watched with anguish as the Persians marched into Athens and torched their undefended homes. Like bulls who reach the sacrificial altar and spook at the baying crowd below, the allies began to panic. Many wished to flee. But there was to be no escape. The Persians blockaded both exits from the Straits of Salamis, trapping the Greek fleet. There are some who say that it was the scheming Themistocles himself who tipped off the great king, forcing his allies to stand alongside him. I know not whether this is true, but I do know that Themistocles would do anything for his people. Now, trapped in the Straits of Salamis, the Greeks had only two options. Victory or death. Persians hold Athens. They've blockaded the eastern exit from the strait and hold the island of Sitalea as a naval base. The great king has ordered the Egyptians to hold the other exit. They will come upon us here in the Bay of Salamis. And with Athena looking on, we shall crush our foes.
Kairis! Nei, ton tias menos! Why haven't they attacked us already? Were they so rattled by Leonidas's resistance that they fear to face us? You smell that odor, men! Those are your homes, burned by the mead. Those are our sacred temples, desecrated. Now take up your spears, and let no man rest until we return this city to Athena! Thelesh. Kaire, oikodomeo. Tiesti. A Persian landing party approaches. Defend the island! Estoy My word, Aristides. For a stuck-up grouch, you fight with chilling ferocity. The 
Yes, the menos. You and I know better than anyone the value of a good admiral for Mr. Cleese. We ought to target the Persian commanders. Persian camps besmirch the mainland shore. Show these intruders the fate due to all such ill-mannered guests. Ne? Oikotomeo. Ne? Titheles. Aku. Oikotomeo. Kaere. Paino. Oikotomeo. Titheles. Menos. Pulotop, pulotomeo. Prostagmada. Oikotome, oikotome. Ne? Ne? Metaleo. Oikotome. Erkoma. Metaleo. Tiesti. Tiesti. Oikodomeo. Ne? Aku. Titele. Ne tondia. Es menos. Aku. Oeis. Oikodomeo. Haitoemos. Oikodomeo. Tithele, Aku, Paino, Oikotomeo, A Persian landing party approaches. Defend the island. Kulotomeo. Eh, eh, Fuma. Paino. Ne? Episcuatsu. Kaere. Episcuatsu. Ne? Etoimos. Kikensome! Kaere. Let's 
dice la espuma. ¡Quite! ¡Hasta luego! ¡Ay, tú eres! ¡Ay, tú tomé! Caere, Erchomai, Baino, Ulotomeo. A Persian landing party approaches. Defend the island. Rostagatha, Baino, hey. Tontia. Tiestin, Akuo, Oeso, Menos, Baino. Nay, Tontia, Akuo. As menos. Ite Andres! Oyes. Baino. Ejumai. Nei, tontías menos. Acuo. ¡Hola, Ley! Ahí estamos. Oye, Codomeo. Caire. Tia. 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 Prostagmata? Nei, tontia! Kaire! Erkumai! Kaire, itele! Prosparo! Tiesti! Xerxes comes for Salamis! Drive his forces back! I'm wounded. Prostagmata, Akuo, Ephomai. Espalo! Athanaeoi! Caere, Medaleo. Caere, vai isso.
Net on dia. The Persians attempt to land on Salamis. We must drive them off. The Black Spirits of Death have left me alone for now. Yes, they do, Enos. Ne? Bailo. Kaire, er fagotome. Ne? Hetoimos. Metal Yuo. Kaire. Hetoimos. Net on dia. Oikotome. The Persians attempt to land on Salamis. We must drive them off. Net on dia. Diez de menos. Eh? Eh, foda. Oye, eso. 
Xerxes comes for Salamis! Drive his forces back! We on Salamis are no strangers to violence, for here Ajax was raised. Yet the destruction that rages around us now, why might alas? Bring my poor serving girls safely to the temple, Themistocles. Persians mean to land on Salamis. We have slain Ariabignes, 
the son of Darius himself, dead on Attic shores. Persians mean to land on Salamis. Just as bold Theseus rid this land of ravening beasts, so we shall cleanse Attic soil of these invaders. My thanks, Themistocles. Here in the temple, we have many artifacts that once belonged to mighty Ajax. You may take one. In this hour of need. Pegastagon will issue no more commands, except to the black robed ferryman. Slaughtered Megabatsus, loyal lapdog of the Persian king. <laughs> Athena be praised for this victory. Gather the shields of the Medes. These will make five. Persians mean to land on Salamis. You should have stayed home in Thebes, Ariamardus. Attica has nothing for you but death. The king's foremost commanders are naught but bloated corpses now. Ares, witness this deed, and grant us the strength for many more. The camps are cleared. Their stay on Attic soil was a short one. Ostagmata, Tithelais. Ulotomeo. There they are, the king's Egyptian slaves in their ships of acacia wood. The 
Persian landing party approaches. Defend the island! Of all the Persian king's subjects, none despise him more than the Egyptians. He should never have depended on these unreliable wretches to bottle us in the strait. mean to land on Salamis. I counseled the king against fighting you here, Athenian. No matter, I shall crush you all the same. Athens has turned back fiercer warrior queens than you, Artemisia. And just as Theseus fought off the Amazons, so we shall put a stop to your invasion. Back on Attic shores once more. 
Onward, man! Retake the Piraeus! around and get us back to Halicarnassus. Ram anyone, friend or foe, who tries to stop us. Victory! Let the great king see that all his fine ships and all his thundering myriads of men were no match for the cunning of a Greek. Loath as I am to admit it, you fight well, Themistocles. the Medes from Citalea. We have scrubbed this rock clean of the Mede as a mariner scrapes his boat clean of barnacles. 